Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good morning, good afternoon. Revolutionary greetings from Germany. My name is Dr. Bernadette Tega. I have been active within the leadership of our struggle for almost a year now. I started working within the Secretariat of PATASA as a coordinator for relief and support and resource mobilization activities in Europe. Uh, with the, within the Governing Council, I worked with as Secretary of Strategy and Coordination and now currently as the Director for Protocols and International Relations within the Presidency of the Federal Republic of Ambazonia. And if there is one thing I know for sure about our struggle is our freedom comes with responsibilities. Responsibilities to ourselves, to our nation, and to the international community. Thomas Sankara once said, without patriotic political education, a soldier is a potential criminal. We have seen how soldiers of La Republic with no political education have been have have been behaving to our people. It is incumbent on us as a people to ensure that political education becomes a foundation on which we base our revolution. In order for us to assume our responsibilities effectively and deliver when we are in Boya, we have to sensitize and educate ourselves. Failing to initiate the education process now will only increase our chances of being a failed state. By political education, what do I mean? We have to work our way through a series of questions. Why are we in a revolution in the first place? Why are we so prepared to lose our lives? Why do we have to make sacrifices and what is sacrifice? What does it mean to live free and enjoy human rights and liberties? We have to start educating ourselves on the kind of Ambazonia we would like to build. By political education, I mean also, it is for us to understand the world we find our selves in and how we operate in that world. It means to build community and grassroots participation and ownership that is lacking currently. We need to understand the language of the international community and be able to speak it. Our messaging needs to be cohesive and coherent so we do not speak in different languages. Political education cannot be something we learn by accident. It has to be cultivated and taught. It is based on this conviction that the formation of a revolutionary platform has been necessary. And that is the rule I see the Southern Cameroon's Congress of the People scope playing. SCOPE is going to support our leaders and the interim government by creating an environment for fundamental political discourse and debate. We should bear in mind that international relations are driven by interest and not human rights. Why should France, China or Britain defend human rights in Ambazonia and what and support our quest for independence. Why should the international community support Ambazonia knowing that it might lead to the collapse of the Semak zone? Each Ambazonian should be schooled to know how to manage such reservations and this can only be achieved 
using a socio-political platform like SCOPE. We have to debate and deliberate on our responsibilities post-Boya. Using our blueprint to formulate how we will participate to make sure the United Nations Sustainable Development Goal becomes a success. And with that, I would say I am Ambazonia, I am IG, and I am Scope. Thank you, Aluta Continua.